Texas alert now. Back down to Miami. Bet this is a story you did not expect to see today. Justin Bieber is now before the judge in courts. Resisting without violence and driving with an expired driver's license. And who is representing the state and who's representing the defense in this case? Uh, good afternoon. I'm sorry. Go ahead. All right. Good afternoon, Your Honor. Roy Blank appearing on behalf of Mr. Bieber by his manager. And my partner has attempted to talk to Mr. Bieber at the TGK, but they would not allow him in. But we'll be able to proceed in any event. Okay. Thank you. One president, State Your Honor. All right. No, Mr. Monroe. Craig, on behalf of the state. All right. Mr. Perez and Mr. Craig? Craig. Craig. Okay. State? Judge, on the case of Mr. Bieber, the state is just asking us to be set. Your Honor, we agree with that. Okay, what would the standard bond be? On the count of resisting without violence? $1,000. EY, $1,000. On the account of expired driver's license. Corrections, what's standard on uh, expired DL? 500. 500. 500, Your Honor. So the total bond would be uh, $2,500, broken down, $1,000 resisting without violence, $1,000 for the DUI, and $500 for the expired driver's license. Is there anything else before me involving Mr. Bieber? No, Your Honor, but thank you very much for hearing us right away, and we appreciate Your Honor's courtesy. You're welcome. Okay, that was short and sweet. You saw Justin Bieber there making his first court appearance. Uh, hard to know what was going through his head. He didn't speak at all. He looked sort of alternately bored and possibly surly. Uh, here he's smiling in his mug shot. And I believe the next gentleman who just stepped in was R&B singer Khalil, who was also arrested and allegedly drag racing at the same time that night. Resisting arrest, DUI, expired license from the state of Georgia. Uh, Phil Keating's on the story, too, live outside the courtroom. Phil, uh, $2,500. He meets bail. He walks out. Is that what happens next? Yeah, not a, not a word spoken out of Justin Bieber's mouth, all handled by very high-priced and very high-profile defense attorney Roy Black, who has been on just about every super high-profile case in Southern Florida for decades. Uh, Justin Bieber, we expect, will uh, soon be leaving the Miami-Dade jail sometime in the next hour or two after the bond is posted. Uh, Khalil Sharif, his buddy, uh, also a recording artist, artist known as Crazy Khalil, uh, he was the one, according to police, driving the red Ferrari while police say Justin Bieber, 19 years old, left a nightclub in South Beach and was then just north of South Beach in Miami Beach proper driving a yellow Lamborghini in a zone, a residential zone where the posted speed limit is 30 miles an hour. And by the time they had accelerated from zero up to about 60, that's when police intervened. And that's when they went up to the car of Bieber. They said they smelled a strong odor of booze inside his yellow Lamborghini, saw bloodshot eyes, and uh, Justin Bieber appeared to be acting in somewhat of a stupor. And they said, according to the arrest affidavit, that Justin Bieber uh, was very defiant and very disrespectful, uh, dropping F-bomb after F-bomb at the arresting officer, uh, questioning why he was being arrested, what did he do wrong, etc. But Justin Bieber, uh, smiling in that mugshot, looking almost like a glamour photo, a uh, very contrasting uh, image of him in the jail on this closed-circuit TV monitor uh, to the courthouse, uh, not saying a word, uh, kind of looking very demure and very subdued uh, when he was facing the judge. And Phil, so. we just saw a shot there quickly of Roy Black, the attorney you described there, well-known in, in Southern Florida. But the police are saying that Bieber admitted to smoking marijuana, admitted to taking prescription medication, and admitted to drinking? Yep. Did, did he take a field right. test? Do we know that? Uh, they did the uh, the test here at the Miami Beach Police Department behind me, where Bieber not only 
did the uh, submitted for the blood alcohol test, the results of which are still pending. So we don't know exactly uh, how allegedly drunk he was, according to police. But they say that once he was in custody, he admitted to having smoked pot, drink beer, as well as popping prescription antidepressant pills, specifically what kind, we don't know. Uh, but they said first he was belligerent up there on the scene on 41st Street and Pine Tree. But by the time they got him here to the police department, and this is around 4.35 a.m. this morning after a long night out, they say Bieber was quite cooperative. Just three nights ago, Bieber was Instagram photoing himself here in Miami at a strip club claiming he dropped $75,000 on strippers. Uh, so he He's been putting himself in the news day after day, despite the incident out in Calabasas, California, uh -huh. last week, where he's accused by his neighbor of egging the house, causing 20 grand in damage. All right, Phil, thank you. Phil Keating live there in Miami. When there are more updates yeah. on this, we'll pass them to you. Yeah. One report suggested they used two other cars to block off the street and then hold the drag race. And that's when police Look, were if he's alerted, guilty so. of these things, and obviously he hasn't been convicted, he's lucky he didn't kill someone. So this hopefully will be an intervention. All right. In the meantime,